cigarettes, regular and king size, and old gold filters, the best taste yet in a filter cigarette, present Jimmy Durante. In poison for old gold cigarettes. This is Bob Williams for Old Gold Cigarettes, extending an invitation to join us in a half hour of fun and pleasure at the Club Durant. And here's another invitation to pleasure, the smart new pack of OG filters that smokers everywhere are going for. And you'll go for OG too, once you discover the great good taste of today's Old Gold filters. It's a taste that starts with the golden lower leaves, the first to ripen on the tobacco plant. And Old Gold Filters are rich in first leaf flavor. Then, through an exclusive flavor fresh process, all the goodness of the rich, wonderful golden lower leaves is held at its flavor peak until the moment you light up. Now you try today's Old Gold Filters in the smart new pack. And when you do, you're sure to get the best taste yet in a filter cigarette. And now, let's meet Jimmy Durante. One of the greatest performers I've ever known was the little lady from Brazil, Carmen Miranda. Her last appearance was here in this show with me, and she was never better. I'm sure she would have wanted the millions of people who loved her to see this show. And here's a telegram from a family saying the same thing. So, here it is. Shake hands with a fella dog lover. <laughs> oh, I'm down here to meet Carmen Miranda. Has she got off the boat yet? I don't know. Her luggage is here. Well, I'll try and con contact her. <laughs> That's the Desi Arnaz coat. <laughs> now I'll wait for an answer. Get the wrong answer. <laughs> Girls! Girls! <laughs> I didn't expect it today. <laughs> Say, did you have a nice trip? Oh, oh wonderful. Hey, Jimmy, wonderful. Wait a minute. Where did you get the bird? Oh, Jimmy, it comes from Europe, and it's very, very rare. You see, it's got a long beak, and it talks with a raspy voice. Take it back to Europe. Why? If he ever learns how to play the piano, my job is in jeopardy. <laughs> What's keeping that Miranda? Hello, Jimmy. We didn't know you were aboard. Uh, I'm from the UP. Would you care to make a statement to the press? Why, certainly I'd like to make a statement. Jimmy, what are you saying? You weren't on that ship. It'll be good publicity. Uh, certainly I'd like to make a statement to the press. Uh, make yourself at home. Sit right down. Boy, I had a marvelous trip. <laughs> you know, I just got off the Queen Elizabeth. Just to dinner. And I feel spry and gay. In Europe, all the interviewers down at the dock, they tried to interview me. And even the photographers tried to click me. Jimmy, did you do much traveling while you were in Europe? I sure did. I traveled all over the world. And every place I visited, I gave my favorite girl a lock of my hair. What a fool I was to visit the Towers and Islands. <laughs> you know that European trip did me no harm. One look and you'll spot my continental charm. Why, you can tell them a walk, tell them a talk, that Durante has been abroad. Why, you can tell them a smile, tell them a style, that culture has been my report. Now, the things that I did, the things that I saw, would take most people years. And like everyone else, that goes abroad, 
I'd like to show you my souvenirs. Folks, now tell the truth. Ain't this better than an ashtray? And ain't that better than a tie? You know, perfume evaporates and gets your raven mad. But this'll last a lifetime with a package ain't bad. This I found in Italy. And fellas, ask yourself, wouldn't that look nice on your knick-knack shelf? In France, this is the best I could get. I would have taken one, but they refused to break up the set. <laughs> Folks, I had a lot of trouble getting them through the customs, not to mention the overweight I had to pay. <laughs> Let me introduce them to you. This girl followed me all the way from Italy. Sonia, troppo conviene di essere in America. Non crede che vi gira intelligenza. Them's my sentiments too. <laughs> and this girl followed me all the way from Germany. Das ist eine shiny Kay. Das ist eine shiny Kay. Ich liebe dich. Ich liebe dich als Wiedersehen. Well, I'm dust. And these girls followed me all the way from France. Oh, mon petit, mon cher, mon jimmy. Il y a deux choses dans la nuit. Le bon vin et le mur. Well? Oui. <laughs> Just the way I dictated it. <laughs> and this girl, uh... <laughs> I don't know what language she speaks, but I like the way she said it. <laughs> now, folks, what's my secret? Well, I'll tell it to you. I can treat them in a manner. They're un unaccustomed to. I bought her diamond ring. I bought her pretty thing. And since I bought those pearls, you can see she loves me like the rest of the girls. I saw her smile and wink. Then I bought that mink. I wind them and dine them at the Valley Bouchard. Like old Mother Hubbard, my wallet is bare. I bought them this. For those of you who just tuned in, this is not what's my life. <laughs> I bought them this and that on the Ruby Lafayette. That's why I'm up from today. Girls, I'll see you at the club tonight. I wonder what's keeping that Miranda. Let's get up! Let's get up. I met the wrong boat. This is Noah's Ark. <laughs> Europe this year. Everybody is going to Europe. Comet! How is my little cucaracha? Well, how is my bonus notches? <laughs> I'm going to work with you at the Club Durant. Tell me, did you find a good apartment for me? No, I thought your agent was going to get you an apartment. No, I sent a telegram. And the telegram said, I want an apartment, bonito, bem engraçadinho, gostosinho, que eu posso dormir muito bem, numa rua bem gostosa, bem bem a minha vontade, do jeito que eu quero, assinado com meu nome. I wish I could put that speech on the medic program and have it examined. <laughs> But I'm going to stay, Jimmy. Why, you're going to stay at my apartment. Ah. But make sure the landlord don't find out, because he don't like me to sublease. Ah! 
Thank you very, very much. You wonderful. Thank you very, very much. You wonderful. Thank you very, very much. You wonderful man. That's why você sabe você é uma maravilha. Um ser formidável, tão formidável que você não pode imaginar. Você é um ser perfeito. Para mim é uma maravilha. Pronto, acabou. There's that same speech back from medic, and it still ain't cured. <laughs> Jimmy, what a beautiful apartment you have. Oh, mine. And I furnished it all myself. Is it? My Louis Cortez couch. Oh. <laughs> my uh, ripple white chair with the original ripple still in it. <laughs> and the pride and joy of my house, my drunken fife table. <laughs> all brand new antiques. <laughs> Where do you want us to put this? Over there. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You got a lot of nerve letting that little guy carry that trunk. Put it down. You carry the trunk. <laughs> you carry that, my little man. Why don't you mind your own business? <laughs> chance of being elected president of the American Federation of Labor. <laughs> Say, Carmen, <laughs> what do you got in that case? Just make up, Jimmy, that's all. It must be that new kind of lipstick. Yeah. It don't rub off, it don't smear off, and uh, you can't even drag it off. <laughs> now, Jim, I'm going to put my new hair to the other hats, okay? All right, okay. sure. Oh. <laughs> and here, and... Then I put this in here. Carmen, do you, uh, do you always put your hats in the refrigerator? Sure. All I do is take them out, brown them in the oven, and they're ready to wear. A novel idea. Instant hats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, good night, Carmen. Good night, Jimmy. Good night, Carmen. I'm going over to Eddie Jackson. Okay. And listen, huh? remember, be quiet. Okay. If the landlord ever finds out that you're living in here, he'll break my lease. Oh, don't worry, Jim. I'll be quiet as a moose. And uh, <laughs> until then, all the snutchers. Uh, your hands are so white and soft, it's like kissing an enchilada. <laughs> reason to believe that you're subletting your apartment. Why, that's a lie. Another crack like that, and I'll start wearing my squeaky shoes after 10 o'clock. <laughs> What's that? Oh, I've been wanting to complain about that. I get that noise every time I let the water out of the bathtub. <laughs> Yeah, but I told you to watch out. No singing. I was not singing. I was just vulcanizing. Vulcanizing? Colin, <laughs> you're beginning to speak English as good as me. <laughs> I wish I was speaking How do you like that? Refugees from Perez Pradro. <laughs> They're not from Perez Pradro. They are musicians. They're going to stay here because I tell you why. Because they don't speak English good like me. There's no room for them here. Tell them to take their bongos and beat it. Let them stay here tonight, Jim. They just sleep on the couch and they be very, very quiet. See, si, very quiet. Very quiet, Bob. Ooh, ooh. They do not know the last straw mumbo. Can you show them? Oh, it goes like this. The last straw mumbo. Oh, 
just dozing off. I thought you were the Sandman. <laughs> I heard voices in here. I must have been talking in my sleep. In Spanish? <laughs> yeah. You must have sent me the wrong dream. <laughs> <laughs> I must be seeing things. If you don't mind, bonus snatches. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I get eight. How many do you get? <laughs> eight feet, huh? Well, let me tell you something. I hope you got an explanation for this, or I'm moving out. Oh, you're moving out, all right. It plainly says in your lease. Just my luck. Probably more feet. <laughs> I got the wrong apartment. Lassie's cocktail party is down the hall. <laughs> well, that does it. You ready? You're moving out. Moody, I'll Enough of that. I've got to stop for that again. Dr. Eddie, I've warned you. Please, Senor Landlord, please. Don't throw him out. It's all my fault. They are my musicians, and I'm leave. Why, Carmen Miranda, I didn't know you were here. Yeah. I'm the president of your fan club. <laughs> <laughs> The Poughkeepsie branch. <laughs> you see, Jimmy, he's the president of the Poughkeepsie branch club. Oh, well, I don't know. No, I don't know. I can't get it. Sit down, sit down. Yes, for you. I better go to the parking lot. That kind of music sets my motor running. <laughs> Faz lembrar o meu passado, faz lembrar o meu rincão Obrigado. Ouvindo assim O tigre lindo, nosso bandolim E o violão Fazendo o ritmo de um bom baião Mas Acelerar minha circulação E traz Uma saudade que é demais Quando eu escuto delicado Por isso eu vou Pra minha terra, para o meu lugar Terra que tem Da saudade muito sabia Tem Mas o que ele tem o seu de anil Tem Falando o que é que a vossa fala Mas que povo delicado que nasceu no meu Brasil Delicado Okay, Bill, now be careful. This fellow's an antique. Yeah, put him right there. That's fine. Thank you. Thank Bob. you very much. Bob. <laughs> well, who's your friend? Gene, meet one of the earliest P. Lard Company tobacco salesmen. Uh, too bad there wasn't television in those days. I'll bet he could have delivered an interesting commercial. Yes, I'll bet he could. What do you suppose he would have said about today's old gold filters? What else but this? Um, Bob, uh, I'm not reading you clearly. Would you do that again? Okay, now watch. Uh -huh. Here it is. Uh, this is good or best taste yet in tobacco rolled small, which of course is cigarette. Ah, uh -huh. uh, where's the filter? Well, the filter's right here where it belongs, on the tip of today's old gold. For, as our friend would say... Uh, I know, for the best taste yet in a filter cigarette. You all know that Carmen Miranda is opening here tonight. And without further ado, I, uh, wait a minute, hold everything. 
Howl everything. Come on, come on, out. Come on, come on, get up. All right, this way, out, out. They had lamb chops here last night and they buried the bones under the floor. Now, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I... To suffer slings and arrows of Altraja's fortune. That's beautiful. Who wrote it? Xavier Cugat. Well, <laughs> now hold it steady. Prepare the bongo drums. I think the world is ready. So here we come. For Lady Bonus Notions, I hope you're impressed. Shake those Moroccos and we'll do the rest. And for your information, there's a new combination. Olé! Olé! Jackson, the Garmin, and Gomez. Well, now in the Bahamas, folks, they know that we're here. You know, I promise to teach them a brand new step. Why, give them the one you won't miss. Something like this. You all the hard ones I'll do uh, hey. What am I doing? Yeah. Why, I haven't learned to put it in reverse yet. Stop the music. Stop the music. Stop the music. You're doing a mamba, I'm doing a mamba, and my sacrilegiac is doing a jitterbug. Ah, yeah, a wonderful idea. I'm out of a breath. Wait, I'll take your lunch. All right, come here, boys. All right, come over here, boys. What is it? Give him the maracas. The maracas. I need the clavis. The clavis. What are you gonna do? Yeah. We're on our way to somewhere. Yeah. I don't need me and you. Uh -huh. Who will be there? Who will be there? What about the big surprise? There may be some other. We're talking fast and nice. We're running away. We're running away. Pick up your back. And we'll come back. And if we stay. And if we stay. We won't come back. We won't come back. Up here you go. Up here you go. We haven't got him. Got our time. But he's gone. And you're gonna have a happy time. Ah. 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 Ah
my favorite song, Stardust. <laughs> Carmen, we were very happy you being with us tonight. Thank you very much, Jim. You know how much I love to work with you. And thanks very much for letting me use your apartment while I was here. But one thing is bothering me. What's that? One of my hats missing. Oh, Carmen, I got a confession to make. Last night I got hungry and I raided the wrong icebox. <laughs> this is all a slip. That's all right, Jim, you know. We're stale anyway. Oh. <laughs> Good night, Jimmy. Good night, Carmen. Good night, Jimmy. Good night, Carmen. Penny for your thoughts. Madam, I am above price. No, you know, I was thinking of the value of fine tobacco. You know, back in the days of uh, Silent Sam here, uh, tobacco was worth its weight in wives. Wives? Tell me more. Well, back in 1619, a shipload of English girls arrived at the Jamestown colony, and those eager bachelors back there paid 120 pounds of tobacco as uh, the marriage fee for a bride. <laughs> well, I'm happy to know it's no longer the custom. <laughs> This tobacco now, would you say this is worth its weight in old gold? You bet I would, because today's old gold filters are rich in these golden lower leaves. The first to ripen on the plant. And that first leaf flavor helps to make old gold filters flavor fresh. You know, there's a smart modern look to the new OG pack, too. And that, my friends, is your invitation to the flavor fresh taste of the old gold filters inside. Take a fresh approach to your smoking enjoyment. Get OG filters in this smart new pack and you'll get golden pleasure. The best taste yet in a filter cigarette. Good night, good night, good night. It's time to say good night. Say, but good night. Folks, I'll be back next week. And good night, folks. And good night, Mrs. Calabash, wherever you are.